Yes, we are here today to kill Medusas, rescue some dwarves, and a whole manner of other things. I'm just wondering what would be good for the Medusas? They're gonna turn our guys to stone quite often, I reckon. We don't have protect from magic. So, that might be a slight issue. So, we'll probably do a lot of running back and forth, I reckon. Fortunately, there is a temple not too far away from us. I think up on the hill here. One of those two. Actually, no, that's the inn. I think it's this one here is the temple. So, we've got that close by. <clears throat> yeah, so a quick recap. In the last episode, we done a fair bit, actually. I don't know what that is. Went to Tidewater Caverns, got the map to Evermore and Isles, headed over to Evermore and Isles. Oh my, got stoned. We lost to Archimage a few times and killed all the gargoyles and shades and skeletons still about the place. Saint Monkey is an absolute beast now because he's got three master skills, which is ridiculous. And to get him a uh, staff, so he can uh, start leveling that up. And then we came over to Barracuda Desert and just cleared the desert of all the griffins and such. And now we're over here at the Red Dwarf Mines. Uh, though recently abandoned by the dwarves, you can still see the craft and care they put into this mine. And we've got a couple quests here. We're to sabotage the lift in the Red Dwarf Mines and head back to Stego Snick in Avli. And also rescue the dwarves from the Red Dwarf Mines and return to the Dwarf King. So two pretty big quests. And to deal with that, or to complete... The uh, sabotaging the lift. Uh, we have to face a few Medusas. Everyone loves Medusas. Yes. The annoying thing here is actually going to be the slimes. We've got sapphire slimes which attack with water. And bloodstone oozes. Sorry, they're not slimes. They're just called oozes. And they do toxic spray. If I've got a um, magical weapon. Oh, actually. We've got a staff of sparks. Or a wand of sparks, sorry. I don't know. So we can use that. And Saint Monkey can just, I don't know, bash them. Look at that. All oh, the sparks on the go. <laughs> that has so many sparks. I should really be close to them for uh get that um splash damage. Ooh, do these break armor? They don't. Right, we're going to be sad when the of sparks potion, not potion, what am I talking about? Wand breaks. Cure paralysis, that's not what we need. Oh yeah, so these mine cars also act as chests. So you can get a little bit, little bit of loot from them. Nothing spectacular, that's but a few bits and bobs here and there. And these are the dwarves. That we have to rescue the stoned dwarves over here. It says they're statues. But no, they are dwarves. Yarrow Keldin. Ah, help! They're coming for me? What happened? Who are you? We are your saviors. Bow down before us. Also, we've got perception. Expert perception. Oh no, just normal perception. Oh jeez. Uh, yeah. It would have been nice to have that expert level, but... 
That's fine. In these mines here, there'll be a lot of ore things in the wall. So, hopefully with her perception level, we can, yep, get them easy enough. Not sure what one that was. Um, skilled craftsman. Enchantability of the steel. Okay, it's just, just whatever. Where is this journal entry? Oh, journal entry. Going fine. We've managed to find a perfect place for the lift engine. Near continuous supply of steam energy. With proper maintenance, that engine should work forever. <coughs> Sorry. Forever. The metals we discovered on the lower floor are much better quality than junk upstairs. Though we haven't seen a lot of gems or precious metals. Hopefully the dig tomorrow turns up something better. Uh, August 12th, 1167. We broke through what appeared to be a natural cave. And we discovered a horrible creature with the body of a snake with a female torso. The mere gaze of these creatures was enough to turn our miners to stone. The rest of us fled. And Drathan Keldon, our engineer, stayed back to try and sabotage that lift. I'm not sure where the creature... Dot 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 came from, I suppose. They were here all along. They didn't come from anywhere. Man, stone skin really runs out quickly. I mean, probably don't need it against these guys. Oh, and I did actually break our bow there. We can't repair it. So uh, definitely starting to be investing points into repair item, if that's the case. Jason Keldon, they're all Keldons. Must be a family. Family of miners. So actually, yeah, blast and heroism won't do anything for us up here. And I think as well, Medusas are immune to spells. So we'll probably just have to melee them to death. Okay, they're toxic clouds. Do a fair bit of damage. Fossil Keldon. Oh yeah, congrats again on your um, level 20 weapon there on Boss Stark. Insane. Don't think a lot of people have a level 20 weapon. Ah, Varric, welcome. <laughs> a nice glow. Oh, so that actually, we took damage from that. That time. Oh, lots of people do. Wow, not many free-to-play players have that. And how are you doing, Varric? Welcome back to the stream. Long time no see. How you been getting on? Oh yeah, did you um did you see the most recent One Piece episode? Oh man. That was that was insane. That was really good. How's Bob doing? Bob's getting on just fine actually. He's um To be honest, he's probably one of the strongest party members. Rikula's hitting a bit harder because she's just got a spear. Um, but he's doing solid. He's definitely keeping the party alive. You've not seen it? Oh, jeez. You need to watch that. You need to go watch it. It's good. It is good. Do like a good One Piece episode. Uh, Red Keldon. How original. 
I won't give, I won't spoil it for you at all, but highly recommend watching it. Once Ricola gets promoted and has a few more spell points, just having extra sparks or lightning damage is going to be pretty nice. That statue moved. I don't think there's statues at all. Let's leave it behind. Ah, Rockstarat with the pizzas. How you doing? We've got Arvin Keldon here. Cool. So yeah, we're rescuing the uh, stoner dwarves. They're absolutely baked. And actually, you know what? They probably could do with some pizza if they're if they're stoned. They might have the munchies. You never know. Is that pineapple pizza? What is that emo? <laughs> That's disgusting. That is actually disgusting. Uh, I'm going to give a little bit mana back to Omai. I think she's going to need it to deal with these future oozes. How many sparks we got left? Seven casts of sparks. So sad. Pineapple pizza is not lovely. I can't believe he just said that. That's it. Disgraceful. Let's leave it behind. Tom Keldon. Welcome. So yeah, as you can see here down the left. Uh oh. I forgot we picked up the golem. Uh, oh, that saved some infantry space, actually. He took all our golem parts. That's good. Yeah, we just got all the dwarves filling up our infantry. That guy looks shifty. They all look a little bit shifty there. Ah, that's a dead end. Always have coconut and chocolate. Yeah, don't you get those, like, dessert pizzas or something, which are, like, just chocolate pies, basically? Uh, oh. Draven Keldon. Ah, everybody run. The snake, the stone snakes are upon us. Uh, oh, uh, what? What I don't understand, right? All the Medusers are down at the bottom of this, um, of the lift, but no Medusa's up here. So how do they all get stoned? It doesn't make any sense. Mustard with hot dogs. It's not quite an original thing though, mustard with hot dogs. People's food cravings are just weird. Okay. It is time to duel with the Medusas. I don't know how well this is going to go because we've only got one person who can cure us if someone gets stoned. Um, so, so yeah. Oh wait, I forgot I need shield. That's going to be huge. So yeah, we need to channel all our pizzas and pineapple pizzas and hot dogs. Oh, and they paralyze as well, apparently. Good thing I've got cure paralysis. Yeah, and as you can see, they're immune to spells. Unless we've got a physical damaging spell? Um, I don't know. Let me check that, actually. We hit hard. Like, our party is definitely not to be messed with. Lightning bolt... Points of... It doesn't actually say what kind of damage that is, but... 
Guessing that's all air. Poison spray is water damage. Acid burst. Is acid burst water damage as well now? Yeah, okay. And then, of course, fireball, fire damage. Oh, blades. Blades might work. Ah, uh, nerdies, how's it going? Welcome. We're just over here. You just made it, actually, for the, the fight against the Medusas. So we'll see how that goes. Yeah. Ooh, iron laced. That's gotta be good. Hopefully we don't get stoned too much, but... Okay, blaze does not work e either, so... It's going to be the good old staff fashion. Heroism still up, isn't it? Fortunately, our team is pretty solid. We've got three decent uh, melee dudes. Um, isn't there a way to get stuck in the cave? Um, maybe. Yeah. I don't, th I don't think there is. Oh, wait. <laughs> I just realized Bob was meleeing them with his fists. I felt there was always a chance with the lift that you could get stuck in here, but I don't think that's actually the case. Oh, if it's bugged, then that's a different... Uh, yeah, that's totally different then if it's bugged. That's it. All oh, this crap. Oh, this is the big Medusa room, isn't it? Or actually, no, it's only one Medusa. Okay. Stone to flesh. So this is the device which um, if, where is it? The worn belt. You can sabotage it to stop the lift. We'll do this at the end. Um, so I think it causes a cave-in or something. You might start taking damage. Oh, why don't I rest for mana? Um... I could. Yeah, if there's more oozes, we might rest. I do have a few more potions left over. Um, hey, what's that? Well, actually, two crappy potions, but we might. Let's leave it behind. Just every time you rest, even if it's green and then in dungeon, he still might get ambushed even though that goes against the game logic where that's green you should be able to rest no bother uh, okay that's actually up at the top there just trying to remember the way Got no magical weapons either, so none of our melee dudes are gonna be able to do anything to that ooze. Stone to flash is quite good. So far, so good. We've not been turned to stone. So fingers crossed, eh? Our regen is just a way to run off. But Empress Medusa. Okay, we can't actually... Oh, Queen and Empress. Which one's stronger, do you think? Go be the Empress, right? Yeah, I'm going to go with the Empress since they've got like, gold armor there. Staff bash him. Man, 
We just delete them. I I thought this was meant to be harder. Oh yeah, doesn't it drop an amulet? Resistance to stone. So actually, you know what? Let's give this over to... Oh my there, just in case someone gets turned to stone. I mean, to be honest, we've got so many of these potions that probably doesn't even matter. Yeah, that's just a crappy chain mail. Alright. Do your thing, team. The bros are back in town. That might be it. I think we've rescued all the dwarves. I've had it before in the past where, like, I've literally thought I've rescued all of them and then missed one. That's been a... that was quite sad. Because I had to run all the way back here. Okay, I will save the game just in case it breaks. And with that, we might actually be done. I know you can actually get underneath the lift. And I guess that's the way back. In case you accidentally get stuck. <laughs> I guess our team's just so strong. Kilo of liches and necromancers and vampires and now Medusa's. We are Perseus, incarnate. Right, the little switchy, switchy Madu thing is over here. And Saint Monkey hey, will do the honors and it should stop. Well, it's meant to stop, but I guess in his own words, let's get out of here. Okay, I thought that was going to take a lot longer than it actually was. I thought we were going to struggle, we were going to die, have to run out and heal multiple times. But we've done it in a one -er. Great. I mean, we're not even that powerful. Anywho, we are finished up with Barracuda Desert for now. We will need to come back for the Sorcerer promotion quest, but we need... What do we need? An arm? I think that's all we need left is an arm. I think an Avali is where we can get it from. I think that's where the last piece is. Because we had two legs, the torso, head, and one arm. Okay, question is, where do we go back to first? Um, we need to go to Avalie anyway. Yeah, the music. I'd have to say Might Magic 6 music, I prefer, but 7 is still quite good. Okay, Sabotage the Lift. Oh, we still need to go to uh, Lord Markham's estate and try and kill the Master of the Sword for the fifth time. Round 5, we're going to Knockout. Maybe when Ricola gets promoted, we might be able to manage that. 
Right, so we need to head to Barrow Downs, which is actually over here to the east. So we'll go do that. We'll go speak to Mr. Dwarf. 